Hi everyone, it's Beck and I'm back with a little show and tell video. I haven't done one of these yet, um, or for a while, I haven't done a video at all. So, um, hopefully everyone's doing well and I've been very busy and lazy at the same time as far as videos go. Um, but I just wanted to show you a couple of, pink, uh, a couple of things that I bought recently. Um, this little pack of layers, botanicals by Tim Holtz. There's 83 pieces in this set and they're just so pretty. Heaps of butterflies. Heaps and heaps of butterflies and all these flowers. There's just so many really cool things in here. 83 pieces. Like what? You could make so many things. So I just wanted to show you that I got that and then where I bought it from. So I don't buy new things very often. Um, I usually try and get re reuse stuff and I have more of that that I bought today or thrift shop, second hand, op shop stuff. But sometimes things really grab my attention and I want them so I get them. So the shop that I usually buy brand new things from, art, um, art supplies and things from, is this online shop, Art by Jenny. She's really, she's got everything that you could possibly want. She's in Australia, so the shipping is not, not crazy. Um, she's an amazing artist as well. So, and she, she did this one on the little card. So cute, Cheshire Cat. Um, so go and check her out. She's got great stuff, reasonably priced, um, brand new art supplies and craft supplies. So I don't think I'm going to get this all back in here in any great hurry. But we'll have a crack. And then I'm going to show you what I got um, today at a new place that I found at Taralba. So if you're central coast, like northern end central coast uh, of New South Wales, Hunter region or Lake Macquarie area, there's a new, well it's been there 10 months she told me today, but it's a, a reuse depot. <clears throat> And she has got so much stuff. It's awesome. Um, and it's just growing. She's only just really started out. And it's just a wonderful place to go. She has a workshop area. She has a shop out the front for made items. And it's called The Maker's Place. And it's in Taralba. Um, they have a Facebook page as well, The Maker's Place, so have a look for that. And I will show you what I got from there today. I've got a big bag of stuff. Lots of fabric, lace, patterns, quilting fabric, more lace, more lace. <clears throat> Alright, so I went a bit nuts. I spent $40, which I thought was pretty good, considering one of these rolls of wallpaper was 10 so... Um, so what did I get? I can get through some of this to actually see. Uh, so I got this. This is brand new. She had 50 cents on it. It's like a crocheted, um, crocheted lace. It's two metres. It's pretty. It was 50 cents. As if you're not going to pick it up. No brainer. Um, I got these packs for five dollars of... I'm imagining they're fat quarters, but they might be bigger than that, actually. 
Um, so they are some really pretty um, fabrics that you would probably use for quilting if you're a quilter, which I have done some quilting, but I bought them because they're pretty and I can use them for anything. I do sew <coughs> and I like florals, so I got those. So like I said, that's quite a lot of fabric for $5. And I got this little one too. And I love this one. This is the one that drew my attention. That's really pretty to me. And then this one as well. This is quite cute. Oh, this is a, like a wedding one. Wedding list, wedding planner. That's cute. That'd be nice, you know wedding journal and this one this is this is pretty the blue is nice and this pink floral as well so that's that was a good, good deal I feel it <clears throat> and then I got this roll this kind of reminded me of um, the seed no, what are they called feed sack florals that you can get so I really liked that it is obviously old it's got damage to the sides some damage you can see or wear not really sure it's faded kind of discolored across there um, so you probably can't use it as a full piece but that's okay I will use it to make something fun and obviously if those parts get into my pattern then I can cover them up with something. But I got all of that for three bucks. That was pretty fun. Um, I picked up four patterns. Um, I got these ones because I liked the images. They're a dollar each. Thought they were really cute. But there's serious Sally here. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I like this one with the sunglasses. This one's got a bit of um, speckledness on it, but that's okay. It adds to it, doesn't it? Apparently. Anyway, all the patterns are in there, so if I wanted to make these items, I could. Probably won't, <laughs> but yeah, dollar each, couldn't say no. Then I got this bag of lace, there's a lot in here for a buck. It is, um, what do you call it, polyester, it's not, it's, you know, nothing special, but it's pretty and there's a lot of it, so I can do something with that. Yeah. And again, for a dollar. Pretty and volume. I like that combo. Then I got this fabric. Now this reminds me of an old sheet. Which it could possibly be from. Um, yeah. I thought that was really pretty. Some of it smells a little bit musty, but not too bad. So I'll probably wash it before I use it. Which is usually what I do when I buy fabric from the op shops and that. <clears throat> and I got this piece of lace, which was 50 cents. Oh, that, that was 50 cents as well. Um, I don't have any... The only pieces of lace like this that I have are a massive big curtain that my mother-in-law gave me and I actually <laughs> want to use it on a window when I get a chance. It's on my to-do list. So what I'd say, this has been cut off the bottom of something like that, like continuous curtaining. But I thought that was really pretty for 50 cents, not bad. Um, yeah, no, I found 
and this massive roll. That was five dollars. So again, there's a lot on it. It's you know, it's nothing super flash or anything, but it's pretty. And I can do something with it, even if that's the basis for a um to add to, you know. And, there, and like I said, there is a lot on there. The center of the roll is only this, and it comes out to here, all the way around. So there's a lot on there. If you're watching this video and you're interested in any of this, just message, comment. Happy to sell some of it for cheap. Share the love. But this is what I was super excited about, these two wallpaper rolls, because I've not been able to get it anywhere. <clears throat> so this one is the first one I got. I'm not sure how vintage it is, but it reminds me of something my grandmother had in her dining room. Um, embossed and it, it's not bad. I could find something to do with that. I don't mind the colours, they're vintagey. I'll go. So, yeah, there's a lot of that if you can see it there. There's a lot. Also, happy to share that if you're interested. Um, and these were not actually very cheap. <clears throat> they had a lot of these vinyl coated ones. Now, I don't know how old this would be, or even if it would tell me. I don't think it says. But, um, the picture on there looks a bit 70s maybe. I'm not sure, but I had, there was a, probably another six or seven rolls of this there, and it feels great, like it, it's vintage for sure, it doesn't have that glossy feel to it, if I can get the plastic off, Ugh. I can keep seeing what I'm doing. Hang on a second. There we go. Sorry about that. All right. deck of Canada. Here we go. Let's see if there's some kind of date on here. Well, even if there was, I wouldn't know because I can't read German or uh, French, I think. It's all English on this side, and there's no dates, so I don't know. Anyway, let's have a look. Ooh, it's very quite fragile. So it's just a yellow daisy motif all the way over. It feels awesome. It's really pretty. I'll get it up close so you can see. Sorry about the light dark here. Yeah. So 
so that's a bit exciting. But there are more there. These were ten dollars a roll, and there is how much? Twelve point eight meters on those. So that's not bad. Um, less than a dollar a meter, but. Uh, happy to share, and if anyone is interested in purchasing a roll, I can buy them for you, but you'll have to pay postage to wherever you are. Um, yeah, so that's that. <clears throat> and that's all I got from there. But I think that's a lot. And I was very happy with that little purchase. I originally went there to get um, some... Things for school. One of the teachers wanted some foam, which I got these massive blocks of foam for like a dollar each. So they're going to use those for some activities with the kids. <coughs> uh, what else have I bought lately? Okay, so I bought from Irene at Seriously Scrapping. I bought from her some Pianola paper. Pianola roll paper. Yeah. So she has this advertised on her Zibit. So if you go to Seriously Scrapping at, um, at Zibit, I think it's .com.au, I'm not sure. Um, but probably most of you know Irene anyway because she... It was the one that encouraged me to start a YouTube channel. <clears throat> and probably most of you have come from her recommendation. <laughs> um, but anyway, so I bought um, two yards from her. And she very generously generously sent me some extras. Um, but I've never had this before. And it's quite nice. It's just like a craft paper. It's a bit shiny on one side. Uh, mat on the other and it's got all of the cutouts where the music is made <clears throat> and on parts of it it's got the words you can see that 